Well, that would be... Do you give a bleep? Do you give a bleep? So what I do is I have you compile five news stories Yes. that I may or may not give a bleep about. Usually uh-huh. I don't give a bleep. No. Nope. And we try to keep the community, we try to keep our community, right? We're community leaders, so we try yes. to keep everybody in, in, informed. Yes. Because in a world where fake news and social media rules everything, like, we want to make sure that you guys actually know some facts. And I actually have a story about that this week. Oh, great. So, <laughs> so what's our first one? First one would be Alan Thick. Yep. My heart goes out to Robin. My heart goes out to his son, Carter. Yeah, Carter. Because, too. you know, Alan Thick died this week of at age sixty nine of a heart attack while he was playing hockey with his nineteen year old son Carter. Yeah, that's got to be tough. So, let's, and let's so for the context, who's Alan Thick? Alan Thick would be the actor that played the dad on Growing Pains. Yep, that's how I know which him the best. Every child of the eighties knows. Yep, because Kirk Cameron got his start there, uh-huh. and Leonardo, Leonardo DiCaprio got his start there. Yes. So. And I think possibly Brad Pitt. No, uh, Johnny Depp, Depp I think, did a couple episodes. No, I thought Brad Pitt was on one of those shows back then. Well, either way, it was a pretty good show. Yeah. I, it doesn't, I, I'm sure there's some, you know what I'll do, I'll try to track an episode down and put it right here. Okay. Um... So, well, what I did not know was that he was also a songwriter. Of course he was. And he, uh, he wrote the themes for Different Strokes and The Facts of Life, as well as numerous game shows. Wasn't he a game show host at some point? I know he's a late night talk show host. He did a late, he's Canada. He is Canada. He is Canada incarnate. Yes. Uh, we had an episode, I, I, was it number five? We did an episode with Canadians. Yes. Didn't ask a Canadian episode. That's a lot of fun if you're not familiar with the culture of Canada. It's a pretty good primer. Um, so, yeah, I give a bleep, kind of. I thought it was rather amusing that his ex-wife said that he went out the way any good Canadian should, playing hockey with his son. It's so. true. We should all go out that way. Mm-hmm. Yep. All right. What's next? All right. 